Hello, this is Johan Vermeulen with Mobility Minded. Uh, this is going to be our fourth video already with the LG Expo from AT&T. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to set up your device to use the fingerprint sensor to unlock your device. Um, since I have it already set up, I have to first unlock it already. Um, the device will have uh, has their own locking system through Windows Mobile, however that's the regular four digit pin. To get to the fingerprint sensor, there are two different ways to get to that settings, uh, to those settings to really lock your device using the fingerprint sensor and to unlock it. Uh, there are two different ways that like I mentioned. First is you can go to the start menu and go to the LG menu right here. Uh, that way you get your four sliders or if you're using the uh, LG user interface you'll have it on one of your bottom sliders right here as well. So let's step on that. Um, as you can see we have four different sliders. Uh, on the bottom you see the settings for the fingerprint sensor and the phone settings. You would think it would be under the fingerprint sensor however the locking feature is in the LG phone settings. So let's step on that and as you can see we get the LG phone settings right here. One of them is the lock button. So let's tap on the lock and as you can see uh, unlock the device with a fingerprint sensor or the password prompt if your device is unused. The password one is the same as you can see in the regular settings normally in the Windows Mobile. So since I already have it turned on I uh, just have to hit the tap the details to see um, the screen. Since I'm already in and um, have it trained already, I actually really have to unlock it again. So, and then I will be able to see it. As you can see, I already have four fingers trained, uh, two thumbs and two index fingers. You see the, the circles, meaning those are trained, and you see uh, an X or a plus if you select one that you want to train. Now, to remove is real easy. You tap the finger, you have a little X, and on the bottom, you will have the option to remove. Uh, the reason why I'm using actually stylus is because these fingers are really small and you really want to really train it well. So I removed the index finger on the right hand and as you see that's now a plus uh, so I can select an, any other finger. I go back to that one because I want to register that one. So you will have to swipe your finger four times. Once, two, three, four, oh the last one didn't go well so let's do it again. There you go. And a fifth one looks like it. Registration successful. So right now you can see that I have a train. Uh, if you go to the menu, you can do the pin setup, which you have to do. It's a six digit pin, just in case the fingerprint scanner doesn't work. So you have to remember a six digit pin for that. You have locked the device uh, after so many minutes. I have it set for five minutes. So let's keep that. Uh, let's exit out of it. And let's lock the device. By holding the end key, you can actually lock it. There you go, it's locked. And let's use that new finger that I just trained. And it says thank you. Okay, so this was Johan Vermilo with Mobility Minded. And we just went over the setup of the fingerprint scanner on the LG Expo by AT&T.